Um, thank you, Mr. President. It's an honor to have you here. Thanks. I'm a first-year student in South Asia Studies. Uh, my question is, regar is in regards to private military contractors. The Uniform Code of Military Justice does not apply to these contractors in Iraq. I asked your Secretary of Defense a couple months ago what law governs their actions. Uh, Mr. I'm going to ask him. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Help. Well, I, was hoping, I was hoping your answer might be a little more specific. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Rumsfeld answered that Iraq has its own domestic laws, which he assumed apply to those private military contractors. However, um, Iraq is clearly not currently capable of enforcing its laws, much less against, you know, over our American military contractors. Um, I would submit to you that in this case, uh, this is one case that privatization is not a solution. Mm. And Mr. President, how do you propose to bring private military contractors under a system of law? Yeah, I appreciate that very much. I wasn't kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was going to pick up the phone and say, Mr. Secretary, I got an interesting question. This is what delegation, I don't mean to be dodging the question, although it's kind of convenient in this case, but never. <laughs> I really will. I'm going to call the secretary and say you brought up a very valid question, and what are we doing about it? Because that's how I work. I'm. Uh, um, thanks. <laughs> yes, ma'am.